It's exam week for students at Bunn High, where they'll be challenged on a variety of subjects. Freshman Raymond Barnes' focus for the next week will be on history, but not because of any test. From the history taught in these hallways to a front row seat, 14-year-old Raymond Barnes set to join lawmakers, educators and civil rights leaders next week at the Martin Luther King Jr. Annual Commemorative Service in Atlanta. It's really just an honor to be able to even be considered. He was invited by the late icon's daughter, Dr. Bernice King, where he'll be performing one of his songs. No matter what odds he was against, he always fought for what he believed in and that just inspires me to do the same, being that he lost his life doing what he had a passion for. Barnes, who performs professionally under the name Ray Emanuel, has more than 100,000 Instagram followers. A few weeks ago, he performed in Raleigh at the John Wall Family Foundation Holiday Invitational. Since most of his fans are younger, Barnes hopes to use his position to highlight Dr. King's teachings. When you're in my position and you're able to get on a stage or use your platform to reach more people and it, like kind of engrave it more into their heads, Raymond's dad, Benjamin Barnes, says that that's exactly what's happening in their family, particularly for Raymond's six-year-old brother. It allows the, the flame of, of, of Dr. King's legacy not to be under a bushel. It kind of it brings it out, let, lets the light shine. The service is run by the King Center, which was founded in 1968, the year of Dr. King's passing. Today would have been his 90th birthday. He was murdered at just 39 years old, unable to see so much of the progress that can be traced back to his efforts. I believe that Dr. King knew that he wouldn't be to there to see what's going on now, but he would love to see that and, and would smile upon it. The MLK commemoration will cap off an exciting week for Barnes, where he'll also be meeting with record executives and plans to release a new single on Friday. In Bunn, I'm Michael Perchik, ABC 11 Eyewitness News.